a customer was manually filling boxes of time-sensitive cooking ingredients for home meal delivery. Occasionally, a packaged ingredient would be missing from the box. Yes. This would result in the company granting a full refund for the entire box of ingredients as the missing item could not be sent and arrive in time to the recipient. The customer needed a way to verify that each box was within the proper weight range and then indicate that all ingredients were present before shipping. This system incorporates three main components, an indexer to space boxes, a scanner to identify the proper weight range, and a check weigher to verify the box weight. Random size boxes are presented to the system from a manual boxing line. The indexer contains two sections. The first section contains a drop-down conveyor that utilizes roller top belting so that the box can remain stationary against the bulkhead as the conveyor travels beneath it without damage to the box. The box is held against the bulkhead until the indexer determines that enough space is available to advance the held back box. This section lifts up, allowing the box to proceed. The next section contains a speed-up conveyor, which propels the box forward, creating a gap between any trailing boxes. This ensures the photo eye can detect the leading edge of the trailing box. Even if the boxes are presented to the indexer front to back, the system is able to separate and appropriately space each box. A barcode with a predetermined weight range is applied to the side of the box in a process upline. The scanner is triggered by the movement of the box between the photo eyes. When the beam is broken, the scanner begins to look for a barcode. The barcode contains the product ID along with the weight range for each box. The barcode information is sent immediately to the controller. The conveyor scale weighs each box and also sends the weight information to the controller. The actual weight of the box is quickly compared with the barcode information to determine if the box is within the proper weight range. If a box is within acceptable weight bounds, it will continue to the next downline process. If the box is not within acceptable weight bounds or a barcode is not readable, it will be diverted via a push divert onto the roller conveyor for inspection and rework. The divert mechanism is on a separate conveyor to ensure that divert activation will not affect scale weight readings. All of the mentioned functions are recorded and stored in our controller. The controller stores all box weights in an SQL database for Ethernet retrieval. This system gives you complete confidence in knowing all boxes leaving your facility are within the proper weight range and our customer assurance that each box has the exact amount of product for each order. Contact us today to learn more about how this solution can save your company money. Be sure to subscribe to our channel to see our latest videos, check out our website, and follow us on Facebook, Twitter, or Google+. Links are in the description. If you have any questions, be sure to mention them in the comment section below.